Hello, it's 8 a.m. in Moscow. You're with RT and I'm Ina Fedra with the latest news for you. An academic in France has been sacked by the Ministry of Defense after questioning the official version of events surrounding the 9-11 attacks. Amérique Shepard's downfall was to write that the events were an American-Israeli conspiracy. He now plans to sue the government. Professor, married, author, and now the scourge of the French Defence Ministry. Amérique Chaprard's crime is to write about the conspiracy theories surrounding 9-11. He's lost his job because of the introduction to his latest book about political crises around the world. The minister took exception, so Amérique had to go. I touched on the taboo, the theory of a conspiracy plot. Apparently, there is only one possibility in an accidental world. All the wars have sprung from this, Afghanistan and so on. The book's introduction highlights one theory which suggests the Twin Towers were blown up as part of an American-Israeli pact. He only wrote it. It's not what he really thinks. He did scientific work. See, it's written here. The theories included here are contesting the official theory of Muslim responsibility. That's not an opinion. Defence Minister Hervé Moran was reportedly outraged and demanded the academic sacking from his job at the French Military College in Paris. The Ministry has refused to comment about the affair. Jean-Dominic Moshe is the French journalist who broke the story. The Ministry of Defence has reacted too brutally. They have transformed him into a victim and not an intellectual opponent, even if what he defends is not good. Mr. Chaprade now intends to sue not only the Ministry of Defence, but the Defence Minister himself on grounds of discrimination of his thoughts for touching, as he says, on a taboo. He's lost his livelihood. Living, he says, in France has become untenable, and he just wants to maintain or rather reclaim his reputation. Anne Smith, RT, Paris.